Okay, thanks for watching. Real quick in this video, we're going to be talking about alligator straps versus leather. The watch that I had originally came with a stainless steel bracelet, but I decided I wanted to maybe change it up, give myself something a little bit of a more formal look. So I started looking around, I started to see what other options were, and there was a alligator strap available from the manufacturer. The alligator strap and the deployant together were like around $600. So I was thinking to myself, maybe I could find an alternative. I started looking around, I found out this company called uh, Watch Strap Warehouse in the UK sells alligator print leather straps specifically for the model I have, the uh, Tag Heuer Carrera Caliber 5. So I said, let me go take a look and see uh, what the difference is between the two. At the same time, I also got the original one with the idea being that I'll compare the original alligator reel to the print, see what the difference is. If the uh, leather print is close enough, I'll just send that back. So I want to share the results with you. Uh, what I'll do is I'm going to just cut right to the pictures here because it'll make it a whole lot easier. Okay, First picture here it shows uh, both straps side by side. If you look, maybe I should keep this a secret. One of them is the real alligator, and the other two are the print. See if you can tell the difference. Let's look at the next picture. These are uh, the straps side by side. Again, one of them is real, one of them is print. By print, I mean it's a leather strap with alligator print. Got another look here also, just to see. I'm trying to I'm trying to go for a different angle here that'll show you maybe like what the thickness is. So by now it should be pretty obvious to you guys which one is the real and which one is the fake. But we'll keep going through here. This is what the back of them look like. Obvious now that the OEM one is the one on the top. Now I'm going to show you the watch, what it looks like with a stainless steel bracelet. This is just a different angle on the stainless steel bracelet. Nice bracelet. This is what it's going to look like with the real alligator leather strap on it. Here it is fully assembled with the new strap and the deployant. give you a different angle here just maybe you can see some of the grain and then last is a uh, shot of the deployment and the movement so I'm gonna go back to the original picture here just so we can look at these side by side and just to see if you guessed it right yes the one on top is the print alligator leather from watch strap warehouse and the one on the bottom is the OEM so you are going to have to decide for you which one is better. For me, I decided to just pay the 300 and get the real Gator because I think it deserves it. Um, they're pretty close, but I think I'd be able to tell the difference. Uh, uh, just in case anyone's asking, I remember I think I paid about maybe $60 for the print. So not bad. I mean, if you don't care about that. To me, I think it was just such an obvious difference that I decided to go with the real. So, if you're thinking about getting um, a alligator strap and want to know what the options are, hopefully this will help you out. Thanks for watching.